Welcome to the Enzo and Lotus YouTube channel. Enzo, what would you like to say? Lotus, comments. What do you think? Well, good morning, boys. Where are we? At the parky? I'll take this off. We don't need to wear that. Ready to go explore? Good morning, YouTube. My name is Will. This one here is Enzo. The little one, as we call him, is Lotus. He's still 65 pounds, but he's a little one. This is the first video of the That Enzo and Lotus YouTube channel. Those of you who subscribe to my channel, which is just my name, Will Sanders, you guys know these guys. I've had them on my channel since basically the beginning. Well, Lotus came later because he came later, literally. My YouTube channel focuses primarily around cars. I just do the pup videos because I enjoy doing them. I started getting a lot of subscribers who were coming for the pup videos and not that pup people don't like cars and vice versa, but it seemed very diverse audiences that would probably benefit from just having their own separate channels. Plus there is some actually some stuff with the pups that I've wanted to do that I couldn't, I don't say I couldn't, but just didn't fit in as well on my other channel. So this is gonna be solely devoted to pups. Basically, this channel is going to focus on strictly the pups and pup related content. You will still see the pups on my personal channel, absolutely. Um, they, they're part of my life. My personal channel is about my life, although centered around cars, um, but they're gonna show up in most every single video. And I will still do pup vlog type videos on that channel, just not as frequently. Whereas this channel will be solely pup stuff. The only car you'll probably really see on this is the FJ because that is quite literally their car. What'd you guys find? Something good? Come on. I don't know what that is, but come on. Basically, we are on a hike today. It's supposed to pour rain. Wow. It's supposed to pour rain starting in an hour or two. And rain all day. So we wanted to get out here while we could. Go for a hike. They love hiking. You know, we could go to the park by our house, throw fetch, and wear them out quicker. Um, but one, that's a high impact. It's kind of like if you were to go exercise by sprinting laps up and down your driveway kind of thing versus going for a long walk or playing a sport or something, you know, they're going to get, it's a lot more low impact, but they get a lot more stimulation out of it, physical and mental. So it's a lot easier on the joints, especially Enzo being bigger. He's 105 pounds. He's not overweight, but he's 105 pounds and joint issues are a concern, obviously with German Shepherds in general. Now I keep referencing we, um, part of that is I, I'm referring to myself and the pups because they're part of this channel. Also my wife, she's not going to be in this video, but she will appear in many of the ongoing videos, I am sure. Especially since she's a teacher and this is, she's down to the wire as far as summer break will start next week. So she'll have some more free time to be around. Wow, this is terrible. Most important thing is if I fall, don't drop the camera. Plus if I wipe out, I really don't wanna to have to wash the inside of the FJ today. So for those of you who have come over from my personal channel, it may not, you may not recognize it because it's a different trail, but this is actually the park we've done some other videos on, some trails. It's a different section. I've talked about how we love this park. One, because it's close to our house, but two, there's a lot of trails. And because the whole park is kind of like on a hill, um, basically you can, there's a lot of trails, but because they're going kind of looping up and around the hill that you don't realize you're so close to other trails and everything. Everything just kind of seems new. It's a bunch of stuff for them to smell and they just love it. They just love hiking. 
I was never big on it before pups, but it makes a lot more sense now to me. Yep, gotta pee on the same broken tree. Wow, this is just, this is gonna be terrible. You guys are gonna be so muddy. Rule number one, if you have a German Shepherd, they're gonna get wet and muddy because you can't just not go outside because the weather's not pleasant. Wow, that sounds amazing. Even yesterday, it rained all day yesterday and Finally, we just went out. I mean, we didn't do anything crazy. We just kind of went for a walk around our house, but it was raining and, you know, we just kind of dealt with it. We try to minimize the mud. Sometimes we'll go to places like Lowe's or some, somewhere indoors. I just didn't have time to do that yesterday. Oh, find something good. All right, well, we're gonna keep hiking unless something crazy happens. We'll uh, pick this up when we uh, get back to the car, I think. You boys okay with that? You okay to keep hiking? It's, uh, it's only been 15 minutes. Probably should stop for water here soon. You can follow them on Instagram. We're gonna do a little live video. And boys, say hi. Say hi to the cameras. Say hi to mom. She watches these from work. Between classes, obviously. Not during class. She wouldn't do that. All right. We are off the uh, wooded trails. See, we were kind of like up there in the hills. And basically, it's kind of hard to see, but like the hill is right here. And we just basically went all the way around it. This is more of a... I mean, it's still a trail, but they bring cars and stuff down here when they need to like government cars like they have to work on stuff I don't know that's why it's really big but it's nice to walk on and you can see people coming from a good distance boys think see it's nice to come in the morning like this on a Friday you know I showed it earlier but I don't know if that is gonna make it into the video or not but it's 750 right now so we've been here for about 20 minutes haven't seen a single soul because it's you know 750 on a Friday morning find something good What'd you boys find? Lotus, you coming? Lotus? I guess he's not coming. Oh, he's coming now. So we can go that way. 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 What'd you boys think? I'm thinking water break actually is what I'm thinking. Don't get too excited. I don't know. I don't have any balls or anything. Jeez. I bet it's not even 70 degrees, virtually no humidity right now. Wow, Enzo. What happened to your nose? It's all muddy. Lotus. That's not very nice. Here, Enzo, you want more? Last drink? No, we're good. Okay. I gotta be honest, that way is definitely the fastest way back and the easiest. Look, but I think we're actually gonna go this way because it's pretty much the longest way back. And since it's gonna rain all day, we might as well make the most of it. This for a normal day, I'd say we'd probably take the shortcut and know that we'll do something again 
late this afternoon, early evening, something, but I don't know that that's going to be much of an option. And we'll still do something, even if that's just playing in our own house or whatever, but let's make the most of the outdoor time, especially since you guys didn't get much yesterday. Finally happened. Ran into somebody else. Back there. No big deal though. We just turn around. There's a bunch of other trails to go on. Where were you? That's not a trail. Lotus, what are you doing? And so it's like, dude, come on. Probably best you just follow Enzo. The red bird. Don't know if that's gonna show up or not. Seriously, Lotus? What's your problem? Puppies. What are you gonna do with them? This this is terrible. I'm so glad you guys chose this way. Uh the whole point was to to wean off some of the mud before we got back to the FJ. This is not going to help. Oh. oh, you come back to help me or just get a little more mud on yourself? Wow, Lotus, you're a mess. I'm sure Enzo is too. We go this way so we can get down to the gravel. Maybe work a little of this mud off. Not that it's gonna make that much of a difference, but every little bit helps, I suppose. out of the uh, trails we're gonna walk along the park here back to the FJ it's probably I don't know quarter of a mile or nah, probably more than that hopefully maybe some of this mud will wear off not likely but I can hope anywhere in the woods but no you wait till we get out here and where were you chasing the squirrel Lotus come break now we gotta go find a bag because I don't have any on me Lotus I think that squirrel done gone up the hill did you find him well I did finally find the bag dispenser <laughs> right next to our car really so I think we'll drive back for that one Lotus we're done hiking buddy Lotus You guys need to get another drink before we get in? Lotus, you can get a drink. Now, I've let you drink in the back before. You make a mess. You need to come out. Come on. Lotus. Lotus. He's like, no. I'm done. Come here, Lotus. <laughs> 